It's a crime that's left a western Kentucky community in shock. Today, a medical examiner ruled that a seven-year-old girl who disappeared while at a football game was murdered. Police say Gabby Doolin's body was found in a creek behind Allen County Scottsville High School, where the game was being played Saturday night. So far, they have not made any arrests, but police say they're checking some leads. This afternoon, Phil Pendleton talked to Gabby's brother and father. He has the story first on Fox. Gabby Doolin's father wanted his son Alec to tell us what his seven-year-old sister meant to him. I'm going to miss how she was always so happy about everything. No matter what was going on, she was always happy. <laughs> it made everybody feel better. The little girl was at Alec's Little League football game Saturday night when police say she disappeared from sight. 30 minutes later, she was found murdered near a creek in a wooded area behind the high school. She loved to kill her and she loved to read. Since her death, her community has flooded the family with support. A GoFundMe page had already raised thousands of dollars by Monday. That means everything, donations, we, we appreciate that, but I'll give anything to have a baby back. The superintendent says that trained guidance counselors will be at every school tomorrow, stating that he realizes that all the children are gonna need all the love and support they can receive. And they're all trained in crisis response, specifically trained on how to address the needs of small children, questions they may have. Since word of the tragedy got out, a makeshift memorial of stuffed animals and angels was made near the spot where she was found. And you know, I have an eight-year-old granddaughter myself, and you know, never know when somebody's going to have to come and comfort you someday. The funeral for Gabby Doolin will be at one o'clock Thursday at the Goad Funeral Home in Scottsville. In Allen County, Phil Pendleton, the Fox 56, 10 o'clock news. The heartbroken family also says they can't understand how someone could do something like this. Gabby's mother told reporters she thought her daughter was safe there. I never thought anything like this would happen to my baby. Never in a million years. I thought she was safe because every time... Oh, he had been there. She knew I told her where she could go and where she couldn't go. Police have not said anything about possible suspects. They're also not releasing any details about the autopsy.